Welcome back everyone. Um, in this episode I will still be restoring the Salem Flamo. And um, hopefully I will be able to fix it within our budget. Which is uh, around eight of a nine thousand uh, dollars still that we have remaining. And hopefully we'll, we'll be able to make a profit out of this car. So let's get going. So last time in the previous episode I actually renovated and uh, repaired the entire chassis and suspension settings and system of this car and um, hopefully uh, today we are going to get to the engine, the gearbox and body parts just like with the previous, the, um, previous car that we restored. Um, so as you can see the entire chassis is now uh, in uh, good condition again. I decided to repair them up till 80% if I can repair it manually and um, replace any parts that are really below that. But uh, let's now get going with these engines. Okay so let's tear out all the easy parts first. Um, this gone, radiator gone, circuit time belts, then the rollers, those are all in pretty bad shape, as it seems. Tensioner, timing belts, but as I said, I will repair this car up to 80% manually and uh, replace all the parts below that. And hopefully that will allow us to uh, make a nice profit on this car. And I will just respect factory color as well. well. Maybe I will not even. So in future um, updates, um, the developers of this game are were actually talking about that body parts will no longer be painted automatically uh, when installing them. Um, which I think is really much much better because it's quite strange that now the moment we replace body parts they actually have the color already of the car. Um, it's quite unrealistic. So that they are going to change I believe and um, I think it's for the best because it really forces you to repaint the cars um, the moment you fix those kind of parts. I mean the assignments now already have um, obligatory, or, no, yeah, it's not, it's, it's not completely, what am I missing? What is still, ah, here, the ignition module. Let me also get the starter for the gearbox. So let's open up the engine head. These are the most expensive and critical parts. Oh, we, by the way, I only have like 8,000 left. So I have to be careful. Get the conrods out. Might be a bit expensive though to totally remove and repair all the conrods. Um, I will get the filter. Which is also in not that great shape. Let's get underneath the car. So, crankshaft bearing caps, let's remove those. Luckily we can repair those usually, um, to good condition. Um, then we need the crankshaft out, but maybe this from first. And let's remove then the gearbox also. Great. Now we lower it again, get the engine block out, and start restoring the car. Oh, well, it was only the coffer, but the 
it's not that expensive. So the radiator is done. Water pump as well. Well, it's not going that bad. Gearbox, nice. Engine block I'm mostly worried about. If that breaks, it will cost us a lot of money to replace. base those are cheap parts if they break too bad then ah oh no ah we did ah we have to buy an engine head it's Really. That hurts. Because that will actually be quite expensive. <sighs> Along with all the other stuff, like. Well, the filter is actually something that we just replace anyway. Oh, but that's expensive, the en engine blocks usually. No, this is. Ah, not happy about that. Okay, let's see what can we... Or oh, the fuel tank we can actually sell. Drive shaft, we also have to buy a new. Filter and a coffer, I believe we need. Yep. This, I think, yeah, we need two new clips. Clip A. That is fixed. Now we are dealing with the pistons. Um, oh, the camshaft caps as well. Ah, I think we have to buy new pistons. Those are also not that cheap. Oh, I do hope. This off. In the worst case, we have to. I have to get it back up. We have to actually reinstall some bad parts or uh, crankshaft. Luckily, we were able to repair those. Not to mint condition, but good enough. Crank. Those are luckily not that expensive. Okay, front exhaust section. Uh, what was it again? R4 SOHC. Left. 
But we can also still sell all the... Oh yeah, the engine head. This was a... R4. Yeah, those crankshaft caps, we have to replace them all. Oh, what was it? Camshaft, eh? Sorry. <laughs> camshaft. I think. Yeah. Yeah, like I said, of course we do also we also still need to sell off the rotten parts, which are useless. Oh the engine head cover. Oh, I bought the wrong one. Oh, well, at least the other one will be of use at some point, but can at least this we don't have to buy. It's also still good. The throttle is luckily good. Ah, luckily this is also fine. Now that we do need to buy some um, spark plugs, I think, but that's cheap. We never. You are never going to uh, get bankrupt because of four spark spark plugs. It's so. Those are so cheap to replace. It's really bad if you don't replace those, I think. Uh, cam gear. What kind of R4 is Cam. This one. Uh, Another 130. Another oh, timing belt. Timing. This one, this that one is cheap. Belt tensioner. Belt. The coffer, at least that we were able to. Oh, the crankshaft pulley. Pulley. Was it again? Uh, R4, yeah. This one. I think we'll make it. I need a roller, A. Roller, A. Come on, yeah. Serpentine belt. Seems that the engine is finished now. Oh, we need a new battery, of course. Battery. It's been a while since I was so short on cash. But brake servo. I can just put in. 
Oh yeah, the... That we need to do from underneath the car. And we still need to change the body panels, of course. There we have an oil pan. Oops. Now we need a flywheel. Pressure plates, gearbox. At least we don't have to replace the gearbox itself. Those are also pretty expensive. Plus release bearing. This one. Oh yeah, we do need to replace the, um, uh, the drive shaft. That is pretty expensive, I believe, right? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Well, let's see. Drive shafts. Six hundred and fifty. We're down to three thousand. But at least we're almost done now. And we still have to sell parts. Oh, well, I forgot this still. From the preview, from the suspension. Now we need to lower it again. Assemble the starter. And the ignition module. Oh, okay. So that we also need to buy then. Ignition module. Good. Oh yeah, we also need the wires. True. The ignition module. Ah, uh, oh yeah, Just like this. fuel filter and the uh, ignition wires this one we need and a fuel filter that's cheap good that seems to be it for all the engine parts now that's a uh, Stall the the wheels again. I believe we have we were able to restore all of them. Is that correct? Yeah. Well, all of them enough at least. Well, it saves us some, some money. This one will, will be. The Worst shape, but it has it ha will have to do. I don't like it, but it will have to do. Um, or I can try to fix it. Let's, let's try and fix this one as well. I want it to be shiny. Yeah, let's fix it. Yeah, okay, good. 95% should be shiny enough. Because if you want to sell a car, not that it will matter here, it does matter what the, how the car looks, of course. I think that this is now done. So we can just add some oil. to the center and let's start ripping off these body parts I think This 
we're lucky that we can repair so well all these things. For the body parts, I do want to have 100% though, because I think that... I mean, that shows, right? So, it's important. We lost two parts now. Two parts made it to 100. Three parts made it to 100. Four. Ah. Okay. I do hope that um, we had one extra. We don't have to. That's gone. That's gone. That was gone, of course. The hood can be replaced. This is all stuff that this we can reinstall. No. Okay, what do we need? A front left door, a front left fender. Those are the first two. Um, Flamo. It's called. Salem Flamo. Left door and left fender. That's for sure what we need. And then we need a front. Front. Here we have front windows. Then we need some headlights, right side headlights and right side fender. Right fender and right headlights. And a right door, of course. This one. The only thing we now need is tail lights. Two of them. Left tail light. Right tail light. Okay, the car seems to be totally restored. Great. Great. So, how much will it fetch now? 27,000. That's good. So, the only thing... Oh, we, we are missing these U-bolts. think that it will matter but I like it and I can still spare the 500 bucks because I was just a factory color paint car yeah so we're down till 933 dollars but we uh, restored the car again the Salem Flamo and it looks magnificent if I say so myself. I'm very happy with the outcome. It's shiny, it's new. I really like it. Okay, let's have a test drive and then we... Um, then we actually sell it off. Because we need the money. Sadly, but true. And then of course I have another car still standing by, which I also bought at previous auction. It's a much more modern car.
But at least the car is now fixed. Forgetting about that little incident then. But uh, the car is fixed, so it should fetch quite a bit of cash. Look at that engine. All new. Like how that looks. Okay, let's say goodbye. Twenty-seven thousand. There we go. The only thing that is now is yet uh, that I have to do is just sell off the parts, but I will not bore you with that. So let's continue next time. We need one more experience point for another upgrade. Oh, that's a shame. But we need one more experience point for the next upgrade, so... Um, and with that next upgrade, I will either do... Fast manual inspection... Of examination, sorry... Or... We can go into the... Customization of the garage... That you can also buy with upgrade points... I'm quite... Um, curious what we can um, change there... But... Uh, that's for another time... Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed. Oh, let me show you just to um, as a last thing to uh, to do. Let me show you. We, we still have that, uh, of course, the the that car that we actually restored last episode. I still have that one. I will keep it. But we also, I also bought the uh, the other one from the auction. And I think that is the next car to uh, start restoring. This one we will keep. It's this one. Oh no no. I will. Uh, I mean I already did this model. So I will just keep it. And I will either do it myself. and um, Unless you guys really want to see uh, the same model again. But I guess not. Uh, to fetch some money. And then we can go ahead and purchase new cars again. Or let new. Let's say new auctioned. Uh, cars um, to earn more money okay and with that I would like to conclude for this episode take care and um, see you guys next time